for me if i'm audible and yes yes you are visible right now so good morning how are you doing good afternoon rather it's already 12 yes ma'am very good afternoon yes i am how very are good. you mm -hmm. i'm very what about you yes i am doing good too thank you so how was your day so far yes ma'am everything is going well yeah and, okay uh, yes and today's weather is also very fine so yeah everything is good okay okay nice yeah please introduce yourself before we, we begin yes definitely so my name is vastu murmu and i am from jamtara in jharkhand state and uh, i am a graduate and my hobby is to uh, playing football i like very much actually yeah and these days i am improving my language so you can say my this part time goal is to improve my language because speaking english is very important for me because i have to face the my interview in english language that's why i am learning this language yeah and yeah while scrolling on youtube i found your video so from that video uh, i decided to talk to you because you are speaking very fluently so if i thought that if i get a chance to talk to you so definitely i will connect to you so i hadn't even expected that i will get a chance to talk to you so right today i am talking to you and that's why i am very happy and i am letting my voice to okay okay no issues yes i'm happy also connecting to you so uh, shall i introduce myself yes yes definitely okay uh, so as you know my name is shanta currently i'm working as a spoken english trainer i live in karnataka i have completed my engineering in computer science and very recently i started a youtube channel where i'm connecting with people talking to them helping them and addressing any issues if they have with english i'm just sharing my knowledge in this way i'm also getting to connect to people and know about their lives so i'm liking interacting with people so that's a little bit about me i'm a full time homemaker as well yeah so ma'am uh, i got to know about you from one of my friends she is telling me that uh, you have been speaking this language from childhood so is it true yes I mean, it, you have been using this language in your home also yes yes i was like as a child i went to an english medium school so i learned english in school and after coming back home also i used to talk in english at my home but after getting married i lost the touch of it because in my in laws home we don't talk english at home we speak a native language which is kannada but as a child i developed this habit and uh, that has helped me improve and uh, learn english yeah according to me so you are very lucky that you got such an environment that because uh, getting environment is very difficult for us especially in village people and in village media nobody will increase to learn this language you have to learn by yourself because if you look around yourself in village area so nobody is doing such work that can motivate you so yeah so getting environment really very important yes yes it is true actually now you know initially i would not realize the importance of this language or it was it was natural people around me were talking like me so i never knew there are so many learners who are finding it difficult to learn english i was not exposed to such an environment but after starting my youtube channel there are many people who are telling me that you are lucky that you got an environment and who are not in this environment are very you know it's difficult for them to learn english and yeah get fluent in english did you study in an english medium school did you have a, at least a subject no actually i had subject but we are studying in hindi medium school you can say so is that this language is very necessary so we will have to learn it so that's why we are learning yeah mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. have you completed your graduation i oh, sorry ma'am have you completed your graduation i have been completed in 2021 year okay okay so are you looking for work now yes yes i am looking for for few things so mm -hmm. ma'am uh, most of the viewers of mine are asking you usually ask to me that yeah we are from village area so how can we improve our language so what would you like to ask so what would you like to suggest them for it 
Yes, are you a YouTuber as well? Yes, yes, yes. I do that. Okay. I do the channel. The name of the YouTube channel is Learn English with Vasudev. Yeah. Okay, learn English with Vasudev. Okay, right. Um, let's see. Living in a uh, village area, I've also already spoken to one person. He is also from a village. I think he's from Jharkhand. I'm not sure. Uh, so when I spoke to him, also he was asking me like, uh, he is also living in a village area, but he he is doing so much in order to learn this language, like reading books. Uh, he listens to content, and like you know, you have reached out to me and spoken to uh, speaking to me. So similarly. Try and reach out to people whom you can, you, whom you think you can practice English with. So it, there will be somebody even in the village also because you live in a village and you speak English also. So there must be people like you, so you can practice with them, or you can. See now, everyone has access to the internet, right? There is so much information on the internet on how to learn English, how to improve, how to improve your fluency. So you can do a lot of listening practice like this. Do some listening practice and for speaking if you know after everything if you're not finding any partner to speak just prepare notes and speak to yourself you can prepare speeches just look for a topic whichever is interesting for you choose a very simple topic whichever you are comfortable with just prepare a speech and talk to yourself talk in front of yourself that will boost your confidence and you know when you see yourself talking in english you will get a kind of confidence that i can do it so yeah, I would say look into the mirror or speak, or it is always better to record yourself while speaking. So when you see the recording, right, uh, do this continuously for two or three months. So at the end of the third month, when you like, you know, revisit your first uh, recording, so then you will know how much you have improved. So if you don't have any partner, this is the best thing that you can do. And you know, like there are so many apps that provide you free talk time, right? You can practice audio calls on those apps. You don't have to pay anything. Yeah, you can try that. Try that also. How are you improving? You tell me. How was your journey? Uh, like that. Whenever I get them, there is a lots of free apps, so I use them in audio call, video call, everything. So right now, when I got to know that, yeah, from uh, uploading the YouTube videos, so I can learn also from there, and I can also upload my own channel, create my own channel, and upload on channel from there. I can a lot of things there and I can feedback from others so by this way I use my language here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So where are you currently sitting? Is is are you sitting at your home or outside? Sitting far from my place. So there there is a house you can see a Panchad Bhavan so I am sitting leaning against the wall. Yes uh -huh. uh, from village area so there is not a network issue. So I usually used to come here and I am doing the video from here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's nice wind blowing, right? It's a nice environment, yeah. Um, okay, yeah. I think you must be sometimes get demotivated. So from there, what do you do to, uh, to say key, to come from demotivated to motivation? So what do you do that time? I mean. Mm. Do you mean motivation in general or while learning English for English or in general life? Normally in your life when you feel that, OK, today I'm very much uh, demotivated. So that time, what do you do actually? <laughs> See, you know, I, mm, right, you know, uh, like at that instant, you know what? You don't feel like doing anything when you are demotivated. What you do, you just sit and, you know, my favorite thing to cheer up myself is I watch some content on YouTube. I watch some movies uh, or some from OTT platforms. I just watch some movie and I prefer to watch movies, you know, where there is female lead is very strong. Okay, so that you can learn something. You can see that and you will get the courage. So that's what I do. I, wa I watch movies or any content on the channel, which is, you know, motivating. But I don't listen to speeches, thing like that, speeches or they provide you tips, right? How to motivate yourself. So I don't do, uh, watch or listen to such speeches because I find them boring. So rather than that, I prefer watching content. So that will kind of lift me up and for the next day, I'll be kind of okay. Because, you know, demotivating, it's like for time being, you will be like that. That, that, that will not affect you permanently. So it's okay, take, take a pause, you know. It's okay if you relax the entire day, do something which you like to do. So from the next day, you'll be better. I don't take it much seriously. What do you do? That sometimes happens that when we were doing 
doing something so that then suddenly going to some thing so we get demotivated and we suddenly think that okay i should uh, uh, leave this thing because uh, this is not my cup of tea i am unable to do it sometimes and nobody will tell me how can i do it so definitely and without doing uh, thinking something so we think that okay so let's uh, give up it yeah mm, mm. let's give it up Mm. by watching the videos we can motivate ourselves mm. yes you were asking me some question go ahead so i think this day you are uh, taking class yes i am taking classes as well so any from any particular app app or normally you share the link to the students like this by doing this i mean just like this i sent a link it's a personal you know i give personal tuitions also so i just send send a link and i connect with them okay yes so apart from it so i think that in maps in speaking uh, pronunciation skill is very important because it yes. can or very perfectly so others can't understand anything so definitely this is very important so uh, what do i do for in order to improve my pronunciation skills because uh, i sometimes i feel that i can speak the sentences due to my pronunciation skills my english sounds very bad so that's why i think uh, what should i do to improve my pronunciation skills yes the only way to improve pronunciation skills is you have to listen you have to listen more to the person who you think is uh, pronouncing their words properly right so if you encounter such person online just uh, listen to how they speak listening is the only way in which you can improve your pronunciation because reading you are just reading you can learn vocabulary from from there you can learn sentence structure from there but you don't know how to pronounce that word right unless you listen to a person who is talking well so you can learn pronunciation from there and you must be aware that like, which words you are not pronouncing properly right make a list of those words and try to learn the correct pronunciation listen to the correct pronunciation after listening every word you repeat like 10 times the correct pronunciation repeat it so many times that when next time when you are speaking you have to pronounce the word correctly until then you keep practicing just keep telling about the word so that it uh, remains in your memory that's the only way you can improve your pronunciation and your english is quite good you're not very weak in grammar you're not very bad at pronunciation you're not very bad in sentence formation you're quite good uh, you're learning by yourself all of this yes yes i learned mm. this yeah you're doing quite good when i was seeing my own videos and that time i observed that while speaking with others i am very hesitant you can say so uh, when i think that uh, today i have to face any advanced speaker by only by thinking this i got like uh, what to say hesitant i have come hesitation like and due to hesitation whatever i want to express and that time i unable to express the things that this mm -hmm. thing lot and even i made a uh, five session even then i feel like this that Uh, i have uh, even a lot of hesitation i have and i have to uh, remove this no was today uh, today after watching a motivational video i am <laughs> talking with you because i thought that today i have to face the santam and so we, she is very uh, fluent speaker and she is taking class so uh, after a long time i get a chance to talk to her so i will able to mm -hmm. talk uh, in front of her Yes, yes. By thinking this, I as well, I as well, uh, getting nervous too. <laughs> so I can, I can realize it by the way you're smiling and by the way you're talking. I can realize that you're, you're nervous. So it's okay, relax. Okay, you're asking me how you should get rid of hesitation, right? Yes, yes, yes. Right. Yes, yes. You know, hesitation happens because of lack of practice. like it will take a lot of time it's not like four five sessions later you will be okay it's not like that it will take a lot of lot of practice and if you stop the practice for like one or two weeks so that hesitation will be back that nervousness will be back again 
so don't give up on practice are you talking to people on video calls yes 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 this is this mm, i right. connect connect people here yes yes do that every single day and do not bother if people are speaking fluently compared to you or they are a beginner or do not know as much as you because you know the psychology when uh, when the opposite person is not speaking very good like you you are pretty comfortable but when the opposite person is very good and they are speaking very nicely then you get even more nervous so that is psychology that's natural to happen so it it will come down eventually it will come down keep practicing with people on a regular basis like you can contact people who are good who are beginners whatever because you know when you face the video call it will give you confidence so only that is the issue but you will be okay yeah because this this uh, i am posting my video on youtube so uh or so people are so approaching me to talk with them so i yes. yeah because a uh, lot of people are want to talk to me as well so definitely i am improving my language that's why people are ready to talk to me so yeah this thing is very proud for me that yeah so like others people uh, want this to talk to me so, yeah so this moment is very yeah yeah we we all of us doing this, so others can't understand the people who are not making this type of video only yes making this type of video so yeah mm. uh, some people are from very distant place you can say and they are in very good in other topic you can say but they are not able to speak or uh, english language so due to this language they are connected to us to speak with us so this is very important for us that yes that they are ready to practice with us yeah so this moment is really very proud yes moment. yes yes only when you create this environment people will know about you and they are like willing to talk to you otherwise if you are just in your village and you are not approaching people people will not know about you right now i have started a channel there are so many people who are mailing me for conversations so that is how you have to like you know um, you have taken this initiative you have made your channel you are talking to people so definitely people will help you there are a lot of other learners who want speaking partners like you know it is difficult to practice alone all the time so everybody needs a partner to talk to Yes, yes. So yeah. Yes. Whenever I post the videos on YouTube, just talking skill that time, I noticed that yeah, most of the people who are housemaker, you can say homemaker, they are homemaker. improving. Uh, having said that, you can say they are they have lots of problems. Then also they are speaking. they are practicing they are improving their language so these things motivated me a lot because we now yes. right now so i can do whatever i can nobody will stop me but for them this is very difficult because if their husband is are not supporting and if their in laws are not supporting them so for them i can understand that this thing is very difficult for them and also they are speaking so that thing i uh, recall in my mind that why can't i learn then because they are yes. in spots of difficulties they are overcome from the that problem so why can't i mm. improve so by what yes, is that yes. i mm. motivation i got motivated yes, yes. yes very nice people are like you know struggling they have to fight for everything and still they want to do this that is why they are doing this at least you are independent like you are a boy and it's, it's easier for you so it is nice yeah and if i tell you for example there is a very famous ma'am they have him i uh, yes i was her story and how can he overcome from his uh, her mm. adverse yeah yes i had a conversation with her as well yes, so you I, must have seen that on video <laughs> mm, right yeah it's really great right such people really motivate you yes 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 and especially mm. because they have lots of problems compared yes. to to others problems also and so many home making duties also are there but still we have to like rem- remove time especially for this if you are passionate about this uh, along with all our household chores we have to do this as well i said if uh, and if she has uh, the children so she will have to take care of the children you have to get ready for the school lunch everything there is yes. lots of work for them so, yes yes 
it, yeah, it, that it, is what you know. Mm, because my children went to school, my husband went to his office, but they, I had guests at home. So I was waiting like I, I was waiting. I didn't know when they are going to go. That's why I told you I'll let you know the time later in the morning. So once they went, I told you like I'll join you in half an hour now. Yeah. <laughs> Very, you can say a bad thing or unfortunately thing is that even sometimes even their family members are not supporting them. Yes, that yes. They are very eager to learn this language and people are calling uh, them to what's, what will you do after learning language because you are a homemaker, you do because mm. they don't know that he has a great will to improve. So why we are stopping them? <laughs> like, Yes, yes, yes. They ask you, what is the necessity? Why do you want to? You're not going to job, nothing. Why do you want to do this? Yeah. And and, and especially uh, if I talk about from village, village people mindset. So yeah. they are to especially uh, any, any other if you have to by going any other place. So they will not allow you to go there or do it. Mm. And even this video call, they are not supposed to talk to men. So women are they are talking to women is okay. Yeah, some people's mindset is as such. Yes, yes. Yeah, you are part really, really yeah. They will mm. say that yeah, this uh I mean lots of things are there that you, they will talk like that. Yeah. Yes. And Billy will also bother him that your uh your daughter in law is talking anytime. Yeah. The time is busy over the phone, so what is she doing? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, and it's difficult to explain to every single person what she is doing, why she is doing. Again, they'll ask you questions. So it is not enough if your family is supportive. At least somebody is there to encourage you, then it is enough. At least your family has to be supportive of you. Yes, yes. So for these people, it is really very, very difficult. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, you have any more questions or we could end the session now? I think I, uh, enough, I think I don't mm -hmm. think that. Yes, yes, yeah, we could end the session. It's time up already. Okay, yes, it was lovely talking to you. Thank you for giving me your time. You too, yeah. And if I get a chance second time, so definitely I will talk to you in future. Yes, sure, sure. Okay. Bye-bye. Have a good day. Bye. Bye-bye.